Yo, motherfuckers! Got a battle here against Luca Riley 493. I speak to this guy on Skype quite a lot, and he's a cool guy. He's a much better battler than me, that's for sure. So he leads with a champ, and on calls my Celebi as a stealth rocks, and I go into my Oxy and yawn, but I get the um, confusion hacks. So this is a really long battle, so it's in times four, and it's going to be quite hard in the rate. So if I fuck up, I just keep going. So he gets his rocks up as I go into my Don fan, and I'm just gonna spin on the switch. So what, that worked out well, and I've got um, ice shards, so I'm just gonna try and hit the mints with that. But he goes to his coon, which will take that like a monster. So I'm thinking, I actually have a coon counter here. I got a Riker, so every time he car mines up, I'll car mine, and eventually my TP will do a lot more than his surf will. So I get car mined up, and he goes for a surf, and it takes me out. Which was fucking gay because he got crit, and I was amazed that it killed even with the crit. But he got he has life orb offensive thingy. So I bring in my Celebi because I reckon at least will do a lot. But he goes into his Magnezone, and I'm scared that this Magnezone scarfed, but it isn't. So he gets a Magnet Rise off. I could have got an Earth Power there and done quite a lot of damage, but I didn't. So here I go for the Yawn, and he gets a sub off. But, so he is going to go to sleep, I think. Yeah, he will. And I go for the U-turn, because I'm good, and go into my Don fan, and I'm retarded here, like, he goes for the T-Bolt, and I obviously don't, doesn't affect me, but the Stone Edge won't break the sub, so that was a waste of time. So I go into my, um, Scarf Zapdos, and just gonna whip off a Heat Wave. So, I do that, and he wakes up now, and gets a T-Bolt off of me. And that does quite a lot. So that's pretty uncool, but hey, it doesn't matter that much. So he goes into his mens, and that takes, after the rocks and the heat wave, the next heat wave will take it out. And he bitched about maximum damage, but he got a crit on my Riker, so he can go fuck himself. So he, know, he knows it's scarfed at this point, so he goes into his coon, and goes for a surf. Celebi comes in, and I predict the switch and go for Earth Power, and he knew he called that and gets a free Ice Beam off on me. Which is pretty uncool, but never mind. The next Earth Power will take him out. So that wasn't all bad. At least someone did a lot better. So I'm predicting the Ice Shard here, so I go to my Ape, and he goes for the Fang instead. And I think he's Scarfed, but I never actually sh like find out for sure. I think he was. So he swaps out on the overheat, it's a champ. And that does a lot. And I stone edge there instead of close combat because I forgot about the resist, which was so retarded. So I lose my 8 for nothing. And I'm pretty sure I want to kill myself. But it's a Celebi just comes in for the revenge kill anyway, so it doesn't matter all that much. So he brings in his Mana Swine, and I swore. Oh, I stay in, yeah, to see what he'd lock himself into. He actually has the Ice Shard. So I go in my Uxie because he can take Ice Shards all day long, even though this is actually my special Uxie, or well, my specially defensive one. I have two that are exactly the same, just the EVs are in both defences. So he goes into his main zone and I get a U-turn off, so that's good. Getting my um, Zapdos in now, and all this switching is going to go down, but it's okay because I've got rocks up, so I don't mind all this wearing him down. So I get the heat wave off on the um, zone and it kills him, and I'm scared about the ice shard, so I go back in my Oxy. And I want to get something to sleep, but it's just not going down. So I go for the yawn again. Bang. Yawn. So yeah, I get the yawn off, I'm going to go for the U-turn again. So he goes into the zone. I get the switch advantage again, but I don't, I'm so scared of explosion, I don't want to go to my Zapdos because I need that to take out the Mana Swan. So he goes for rocks, and I'm just going to go for the um, rapid spin again, because I need my Zapdos to be able to switch in a lot. So he goes for the Ice Fang, but this is my physical walls, Don Fang takes it and just earthquakes him away. So I've got that down, and Zong is the only one left. 
And I've got three Pokemon, so it's looking good, but I play like a fucking tired. First of all, I get Stone Age Miss. Terrible doesn't quite kill, so that doesn't matter all that much. Stone Age again, does shit all, he kills me off. And he's got a match here, Brace, I found out in the end, so I'm thinking he's probably tricked, maybe. So I yawn him, and I want to get him to sleep, so then if he does blow up, he, um, can't. And I know from earlier that he's a lev levitator, so the heat wave will do a lot. So I swip in there, switch in there, and I'm so glad I lived. I didn't think about that at all. But I just live and get the heat wave off and win, so good game, Luca. Well done.